So this word resilience. Now some of you have come out to meet with you. We've done some question and answering about what resilience is. And let me tell you, we've had some fantastic answers. Particularly our primary schools have given me some really fantastic answers about what resilience is. Keep going. Um, and some of you have seen that. So Tigger is a good example of somebody who bounces along through life. He's always bouncing back, never lets things get him down. That's being resilient. And again, it, that little plant there, you know, despite all the concrete, that little weed has still come through. Again, having the courage to keep going. I love that one. Have you seen that one before? Yeah. Some of you have. Yeah. You know, just picking yourself up and keeping going. Keep going. And then, essentially, we all feel like that sometimes, don't we? Yeah? And then, what we really do is want to feel like that. And that's what we have to do, isn't it? When we feel like that, we have to keep going so we feel like that. These are the things that knock our young people back in the city. It might be parents falling out or splitting up. It might be worried about parents' health. It might be exams and grades. It might be falling out with friends. It might be feeling bullied um, or intimidated by a situation and so on. All of those things can have an impact on our young, young people. So what does a resilient person look like? Some of you have seen me talk about this. Tend to be resilient people, those people who bounce back, tend to be those people who can have good relationships. They're not falling out with people all the time. They build positive relationships at home, with parents, guardians, with teachers, and with adults generally, and lots and lots of friends. They still fall out from time to time, but that, mean, that doesn't mean to say they don't have good relationships. They can be confident about what they're doing is good, and that they can, they can perform really well. They have hope for the future. So you think, you know what, I'm really looking forward to the summer, I'm looking forward to Easter, I'm looking forward to getting my exams done, you know, you've just got generally that confidence about the future. 